Hello everybody, uh, how to use textile pigment ink transfer solution to print a t-shirt? Now let us to introduce you step by step. The first step, printing this paper transfer film using a textile pigment ink printer. First, it is requested to use textile pigment ink. Then, machine works with two print heads. One head for color ink printing, another head is for white ink printing. Color ink, pre color ink will come out first, then white ink will come out later on the top. Then the next step, this, this is the powder treat machine. It has two functions. The first function, treat the hot melting powder on the printed images. Another function, Heating. Heating the printed images with the hot melting powder. This is the control center of this powder treat machine. You can use this button to adjust the shaking speed. Then you can use this temperature controller to con control the front of guide plate and uh, upset dryer. After finishing the heating, the treated materials will come out from here. Um, after finishing all above steps, in fact, the whole printing already finished. Uh, for now, you can choose to cut the treated images to do the transfer on the t-shirt using a head, head press. Now, let me show you how to do. You can direct, directly cut the treated materials like this. Then to transfer it to the to your t-shirts using a head, head press. You can also all choose to roll up using this take-up system to roll up the treated images. Then, then to do the transfer in one time later. For Sinocana powder, treating machine is equipped with belt and section fan, can heat and cut at the same time, convenient and effectively using the material. While for many other machines without the belt, must install the untreated material on the media take-up system first. To guarantee the smooth media feeding, then start the powder treating and heating process and heat transferring only after all the material treating finished will cause 3 to 5 meters material waste. On my hand, just the treated materials we just printed. Now let me show you how to transfer it to the t-shirt um, um, using this head press. You can choose a place. To put, the, to put the materials well, then put a, pro, a protect paper. You can also call it oil paper. This is mainly to protect the surface of the head press. Okay, let's start the head press. You can give 30 seconds, will be okay. Okay, now let me show you the transfer the effect. Okay. Then remove this thing. Faster, flexible in positioning. You can place the transfer the film on anywhere of the t-shirt as you like. Second, avoid the waste of t-shirt, since you will print on PET film first, then transfer. Avoid the waste of t-shirt due to any unexpected fault. Third, no need pre-printing on t-shirt. No pre-printing of the t-shirt is needed, then save the time. Fourth, good for mass production. 
can print in advance, no need to wait for the t-shirt to be ready, and can print many images at the same time, increase productivity, good for mass production. Faster, lower permeability than DTG printing. The permeability is not so good as DTG printing. Second, more material needed. The PET film transfer film and hot melting powder are needed to finish the printing. But it will mutual offset the cost we can save from DTG printing. Waste of t-shirt pre-printing liquid cost. Third, less environment friendly. The powder printing process will generate some gas, and there will be also some waste of PT film. Fourth, invest is increased. More equipment will be necessary except the print and head press. This solution also needs the powder printing machine and oil film field. In a word, TPIP solution will cause much waste for small printing order. It is good for mass production. While the DTG printing has big advantage for small printing order.